create a data center in the vSphere web client, navigate to the vCenter server object. Right click the vCenter server object in order to see the list of available actions. Select New Data Center, name the data center, and click OK. To create a cluster, browse to a data center in the vSphere web client navigator. Right click the data center object and select New Cluster. Name the cluster. Activate the available DRS, HA, EVC, and virtual SAN features if desired. Click OK when ready in order to create the cluster. To add a host in the vSphere web client, navigate to a data center, cluster, or folder within the data center. Right click the data center, cluster, or folder and select Add Host. Type the IP address or the host name and click Next. Input the administrative account details and click Next. Review the host summary and click Next. You can apply a license to the host at this stage or at a later stage. If desired, you can select Lockdown Mode options to disable remote access for the administrator account after vCenter Server takes control of this host. Review the summary and click Finish to add the new host. It could take several minutes to add the ESX host. Once complete, you will see the new host listed under the relevant object in the vCenter Server inventory. To create new licenses in the vSphere web client, select Administration and under Licensing, select Licenses. Select the Licenses tab, click the Create New Licenses icon. In the text area of the Enter License Key page, enter one license key per line and click Next. On the Edit License Names page, rename the new licenses as appropriate and click Next. On the Ready to Complete page, review the new licenses and click Finish. A new license is created for every license key that you entered. There are several methods available in the vSphere web client in order to configure license settings for an ESXi host. One method is to click on the Assets tab while in the Licenses section. Click Hosts. Right click on the host and select Assign License. Click on the ESXi license and click OK. The license has now been applied to that host.